Hello everyone, Dickfick here and welcome back to another Outer Worlds video. We are actually going to do a side quest up here to Scalania. We would had it for a while now. We had to talk to them about the medic supplies. We went right over the sun. That would be insanely hot and take stupid fuel at that rate, but it's fine. Um, and we're gonna go try and find this guy who's all about this uh, medical shipment and whatnot. For the, the doctor back on Groundbreaker for him real quickly. Um, I just woke up. I'm a little bit out of it, you know. That would be oh, holy sh shit! Cool scenery. Real space, isn't it? Empty and silent. I thought I'd see the light. Uh, I'd this... look up at night, but can't walk five meters without stubbing your toe in a loose rock here. I mean, this has me even just like wow, fucking epic sauce, guys. Holy sh. Shit, this is pretty. Really pretty. Really like this. I'll take a screenshot of that. I don't even know what else to take a screen. Are we actually in a dome? Is that why there's atmosphere? Yeah, it looks like we're in an energy barrier dome kind of situation. Okay. Um As per usual, I guess we'll start our exploration here with uh Find our ship. A freighter wreck here, it looks like. Already finding lootable stuff. So all here. Interesting. I like this place a lot so far. Um, what he said about it, can't go one on foot without stubbing a toe on a rock. Definitely looks right here. This is pretty nuts. Um, also, so is like just the whole human element of this where it's like you look and it's like crazy chaos stones everywhere but then there's just like this giant heap of trash and shit right behind where the humans land and stuff like that it's just kind of like what we do you know i like that it teleports the people onto the elevator it's a good little feature um and get your bludgeoning objects ready got outlaws up here that i'm not friends with Not the best weapon, we'll give it that. But it was worth fucking with a little bit. We'll panel off the mechanoid. I will do work on that. Well, you know, everyone else just kind of eats this to the side of the head. Dead. Is he down? I think he's down. You're down. It does tell me there's one more guy, right? I see you. Ooh, that not big hitbox. Yeah, that made you move your leg, didn't it, buddy? Then off with your head. Um, we'll loot him, because he's the closest guy to us. Only a big old mechanoid here. Plasma rifles. Some of that. So why are there so many outlaws just chilling up here? That ambient shield sound is good. I like it. It feels... Like a powerful energy shield of some sort. I've had some where it's like, eh, sounds okay, but like, nah, it doesn't have any like oomph behind it, and that definitely has some oomph behind it. It feels very good on the sound effects, I think. Just rambling on about the shields. I guess it could be that thing turning causing this the sound. I don't know. I still don't exactly know how these kind of shields would be like maintained and stuff. I, mean, I guess it would have to be like a magnetic field or something which could be what I'm hearing is the high voltage running through that but either way it would be interesting to see exact the the whole technology behind this but I know it's just a video game and clearly the technology doesn't actually exist it would be cool if it did though but in due time as long as our humans don't blow each other to kingdom come we all know how that works um let's check my recording over there make sure not like muted and something's not working right because you know i've done that before and it really really sucks especially on a let's play where you can't like go back and redo a bunch of stuff i'm gonna quick save it right here loot a bunch of stuff killed a bunch of dudes got a workbench here that's kind of nice here a bunch of the little fucking rodent guys yeah we tried Tried to hit them, failed miserably. 
And miserably would most certainly be the word. Oh. The little guy. That was your, your best attempt at me. Holy shit, that is a mega sprite. Took its head off. We weren't trying to mount that to a wall or anything. All the loot. I do like how much loot those mega guys have on them. They're definitely, definitely, definitely worth fighting if you come across them. They really do just pack the loot into them. It's kind of odd. But it's possible that these things will just eat absolutely anything, and the bigger they get, the more they'll eat. So then the more you'll find on them. That, I guess that kind of makes sense in explaining it away. Um, is there anything? Yeah, there's like a weird... A weird box in there that I have never seen before. That I must certainly want to get to, if possible. Poke my head around here. More boxes here. Bigger boxes. Got a journal of some sort. Okay. Uh, let me just finish being a loot whore. And then... I have my keyboard over because I keep hitting it with my mouse. Um, Ringmaster's Log. Crisis time primal performers. Predictably, our primal passengers broke free shortly after landing. I said this would happen after the enclosure malfunction. We hushed up on Byzinium. Why would you hush up man? Who I mean corporate stuff, whatever. Who cares how many tickets we sold? That woman lost an arm. The first and second recovery teams never returned. The only way I can convince the rest of the crew. To form a third team as if I join them, I'm managing my management architect. Wow. Okay, erase them. I'm not supposed to face this type of hazard. So basically, they had to contaminate like all the creatures got out and started fucking ripping people to shreds. I'm leaving this journal with the ship in case we won't return to any circus time employees. Reading this immediately, hand this device to your supervisor and stop reading. Why would you put that at the end? Um, circus time supervisor our plans to present the primal performers were premature the creatures cannot be tamed the next time marketing wants to present an actual circus make one of them lead the damn thing okay interesting so this is like a circus freighter and these creatures that like shredded it and bust that's a fucking cryopod a cryopod jammed in the wreckage of a circus ship that's interesting those are the same cryopods I came in. Is that cryopod or is it the escape pod that I crashed? It might be the escape pod. That's fine then. If it's an escape pod, not a cryopod. Um, this whole darkness thing, man. You can see pretty good in the dark, but like, damn, is this dark. Darker than dark. Um, Acknowledge that the ladder exists, but I want to see what this weird looking chest is in here. I have never seen before. Where are you? Oh, it's not a chest. Lame, I got my hopes up. Uh, Firefly. Is this a Firefly reference? In a space game? Firefly. Don't know the theme song to Firefly. It's been so long. And I was never a super fan. But I did watch it. And it was pretty entertaining. Um, now everyone's gonna hate me and immediately ditch the channel because I don't know the theme song to Firefly off the top of my head. What are you guys hiding up here? More Firefly stuff. Oh, you've got to be hiding something halfway decent up here. Tactical shotgun is not halfway decent. Some books. Uh, I could interact with sleep. Okay, there's a bed up here, Ted. Um, worth hacking into? Yeah, of course it is, because it's free. Why wouldn't you? 38 one-handed melee. That impressive. Not that impressive, just a plasma launcher. Also not that impressive. Five to save it, because I'm pretty sure we full looted this place. Um, went all the way back out here just to do a super double check. There is this whole little downstairs platform here. Um, can we run under here? Yeah, ha, robots. 
can't loot it, but it's there. Do a quick run around this side, then I'll double back. Check that other side and see what we'll find. <laughs> no, not funny, guys. Damn it. Why you guys make me make an ass on myself? It's not even funny. I don't like to think it's funny. I don't think like it's funny. Not really not funny. Pretty big crane arm there. It's built properly? Yeah, it's built fairly respectable. It could take some major weight the way that was built. Um. Got it. Don't stick your head out there. It does a lot of damage really, really fast. Oof. You can go out there, which is really, 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 really cool. This tiny little feature that they did not have to put in this game. I mean, like, this game has so many of those super tiny little details that make it just a fucking pure masterpiece, I tell you. That's a primal behemoth. Way the hell out there. Um, can you poke the primal behemoth? It looks like a hard yes, we can poke the primal behemoth. Should I have poked the primal behemoth? Why not? Are they running out there to meet them? The answer would be a hard yes. Um. Seeing like a health regen loot bug kind of deal. Keeping him shrunk, you guys finish him. No? Okay, fine. Well, he is officially bugged to all shit. Um, he really presumably did not like me hitting them from that far away. Because it done busted this guy in pieces. Can I get close enough to trigger him? Oh, this is what they look like, in case you were wondering. Now we're just gonna walk away and hopefully that rectifies itself while I do some serious dangerous shit jumping up on some rocks in this game because that can straight up break your character. Um, not like delete or anything, I guess you could just reload from a different save so it's not like permanently busted but it can have some negative side effects of oh, actually breaking your character kind of. Ah, so this is actually a layer below my ship. I gotcha here. Um, what are they selling in this vendor? This is Mark II? No. It's all this Mark I stuff, which isn't that impressive. Um, armor? 14, 26, 14, 14. Yeah, it's all fairly low level. 46 is pretty high though. But she's already wearing a 46, I believe. That's not really needed here. I'm playing Fashion Souls, and I'm not going to wear that myself. Because I'm not a big fan of the pink armor. Uh, more power to the people that like it. I'm not against it, but uh, not for me. Not my kind of jam on this character. On the running machine. Check this one already. 26, 22, 20, 26. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Um, why do I hear a little rat? It was destined to die. That 24 XP I desperately needed. Combat drone. What are you doing, combat drone? See your weak point. Nailed it. Um, all right. Yeah, we're pretty fine. Still a few scrapes. Um, that is not a lootable box. That is an explodey box. Um, that is everything looted. You got another crash ship here. People need to learn how to fly their shit. This planet seems to be like coated in crash ships though. Plus that thing. It's really, really interesting. I'm guessing that's like a terraformer of some sort. That would kind of make sense, I guess. How many fumes it's spitting out the top. And I think I've seen something like that on other planets here. It also makes sense that that's just a terraformer. I'm ready for 
Take on the primal. Ow, I just got hit by a rock. I was gonna say, I'm pretty sure we're in some trouble here with this primal. I'm in trouble here. I need to put a fucking magazine in, and I don't have any rapid fire guns at all. They're gonna reset because I got too far away, it would seem. With Kobe, after repeatedly getting beat up by primals, you will no longer function well when they attack you or your companions. Dexterity perception. Ugh. Can't. Just can't take any more negative penalties like that. Um, totally break my build. So I don't like half the stuff I have on my character here. I haven't really left myself many other options because I've just kind of sold everything. Nothing I have is great versus these big motherfuckers. Literally nothing I have. Myself a plasma launcher, I guess. Maybe try it out on them. And does it hit? Do damage? Yeah. Do amazing damage? No. Good enough to actually take one of these things out? Probably not. You buried. You load faster, you fucking thing. Got it. Only because it was too slow and lazy to attack me. But damn it, we got it. And holy freaking loot tastics. Um, the fact that this thing is this efficient, though. Oh, no, well, giving them these would just be a giant waste of time. I only have one of them on my character. Axe, ammo. I'm in that right now. I'm gonna do some looting. Hide. You fit in here. So that's gonna be a thing where, like, I can see the loot in there, so I'm like, oh, I'll just pick it all up. But it's actually, like, a no, you need to actually uh, hack it first. I go hit an E just to loot the things out of it instead of um, holding me to hack it. That's the thing that happens now. I don't know why I like running around with this pistol out. It doesn't really do much for me. Then somebody came in here and did some work on some primals, which is kind of impressive because the primals are not easy to take down. Um, but I guess they're the small primals, which aren't too bad. So I can't give these outlaws that much credit, you know? That was looted already. Kill the primals out there. There should have been something to read or to interact with right here. Captain's Log, Independent Freighter, Gateway Sticks. I wanted to retire on Groundbreaker. One more job, I told myself. Never had any trouble with outlaws until now. I told them what we were hauling, but they shut off comms and opened fire again. They're shooting to wound. It's only a matter of time before this bird falls out of the sky. So I'm sitting here down in hopes that we can broker some agreeable terms of surrender even if it means my head at least the crew gains a fighting chance can't shake the feeling that they were all were ready for me like they knew exactly the route i would take way to end a career yeah it's really unfortunate the very last mission you get fucking screwed over by something it does happen in a world like this though really in jail mr max and you are our vicar yes but as i've repeatedly said I was assigned there as a vicar. I was not a prisoner. I just can't believe you'd lie. I was not lying. It had no bearing on my ability to minister to my flock and was therefore not worth mentioning. 
I'll reload this. That's a primal behemoth. Primal behemoths are fucking monsters. Fucking monsters. Sorry, primal. Don't kill me. Ow. Okay, they're both dead, which is not good news for me. I need to reload. These things are all throwing rocks at me of doom. Can I charge this up and kill one of them? And then run around and get up here again. Kind of like bug them out. Um, you're one shot. So it's got to land the hit, make it count. Then everything should be fine. Um, nailed it. Okay. We are good. Now everyone stand back up. Get your life together. You can carry y'all. Ridiculous. Fine. I'm used to it. Carrying everyone all the time. Why the fuck not now as well? Um, all these little rocks and nooks and crannies make it quite difficult to remember exactly what you've looted and what you haven't looted. Not gonna lie here. Um, didn't loot that, that's for sure. Those guys are dead. Or anything around that? No. Another crashed ship here of some sort. Don't see anything around that. Lucian Vital. Uh, we're just gonna double back here and do one more final check. I'm pretty sure I looted everything around these two things, right? No, I have not been there. Okay. No, well, that's why we double check, because my memory sucks. Good, good on you, shield sound. Still loving you. I um, don't see. Is that a robot corpse? But I'm pretty sure we didn't loot that one. I was correct that was a corpse. I don't know, shipwreckage here. Don't see anything directly around that one, though. But anyways, guys, we're out of time for this episode, so I really do appreciate you stopping by watching. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. And if you did, appearing above me and around me here, there should be a whole bunch of playlists with a whole bunch more videos just like this one. And if you like some of those, think about liking, subscribing, commenting, hitting the notification bell, watching all my content front to back to really help my analytics. And I will see you guys in the next video. Dig big out. Oh, yeah, I'm supposed to do something here. So let's do like, um... Hmm.